Yes, come on. Go in. Can we do it like a little quickly? Yeah. All right, requesting all you wonderful people to kindly settle down as we'll be starting soon. That's what you call royalty. You know, everybody, you know, all the biggies, everybody is going to be saying that, you know, I'm like, and everybody's claiming that they are like your biggest fans. Mm -hmm. If, if we talk about you, are you an Aishwarya Rai Bachchan fan? What the, you're a With due respect, that's a random what, question. No, what, what is that one thing that, that you feel is most amazing about Aishwarya Rai Bachchan? The actor. You have to. Uh, Ravi will say, Ravi will say. Ravi is a big fan boy, no? Say. Certainly not a megalomaniac to be answering this question. <laughs> but kuch to hoga na, jo log dekh rahe hain. See, I'm not going to let you go away with this question. What is that one thing, maybe in this character, Nandini? Well, definitely it's characters, it's, it's the work. Firstly, uh, good evening and uh, namaste and uh, thank you for being with us this um, evening. Thank you for your love, thank you for your support, thank you for your appreciation for this film which is so precious to us so i couldn't uh, start answering the question without expressing heartfelt gratitude for your for all your appreciation and through you uh, to our audience out there because um, your response has been overwhelming to ps1 and with great love and excitement great love and excitement yet again with great love and excitement <laughs> We bring PS2 to you, releasing on 28th of April, and we are as excited as every one of you to watch it. Everyone here on stage, Manigaru, we can't wait to see your magic on screen. Uh, so I just had to put it out there, uh, because I would rather say all that than answer what you just asked, <laughs> being very honest. Um, you know, we, we, we're, all, we're all doing our jobs, 
but um, as artists we are very very blessed and very fortunate that we call our passion our jobs um, to wake up uh, every day uh, uh, whenever you do and to get up and go to work in the name of work to actually have the opportunity to experience wonderful stories being told uh, to get to live the life of these characters who have been either written, either documented. We get to do that, to actually live the lives of so many people because that's what our audience does. There's everybody or somebody out there who relates completely to each and every or a individual character that we essay there on screen and that is the magic of cinema. Now, when we get to do that under the direction of someone as magical as Manigaru, Dhanya uh, Hebe, absolutely blessed. So I'm grateful from day one when I got to face the camera, I got to uh, do so under his direction. And, um, you know, it's a very humbling experience. All this love that we receive, all the, 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 the creative um, forces that come together, to have to give us the privilege of living on in celluloid on celluloid even beyond our time we are very very fortunate and blessed and then to receive this degree of love and appreciation <laughs> and we are very very grateful for this blessing uh, it's very humbling it's very overwhelming and um, actors very very emotional uh, hote hai. and uh, you know, I mean, truly, today, by the end of today, after we've been doing all this media work, I think we're all going through these little waves of extreme emotions. Believe it. I truly, I, I deep down from my soul believe that enjoy it, don't believe it. Right. You know, don't really get all of this into your head. Just focus on what we do, focus on truth, reality. And yes, we are blessed that in our reality, we receive unconditional love. And um, thank you so much, each and every one of you, for all your love and appreciation and blessings. Thank you so much for sharing our, our heritage. And that actually started a dialogue. That video went viral and it almost broke the internet. So this, thank you so much, first of all, for that. And now, with this PS2, kya hone wala hai, son? Kahan tak jayega? Because as I said, you've already started a dialogue that we, we, we should appreciate. We should love our heritage. We should take pride in it. What do you have to say? Hi Naveen, thanks for the awesome introductions that you always do and thank you all for being here and uh, I'm very grateful for the wonderful reviews and everything that you had to say about our film which pushed it even further up there. This has been a very special film for me and uh, what a man, Sumani <laughs> Ratna, working with him, our teacher, our professor, our guru, it was wonderful. It was all work and no play. <laughs> we didn't have fun at the shoot. But we all lived a dream. And this dream is not just our dream of wanting to work with him or to be in a good film. It was a dream of 70 years to make a film, a story that everybody was dying to make into a film. And all of us are so proud to be a part of that film and that each character in that film, each character has a fan club and has always had a fan club. To think that each character has now has a face and it's one of ours, and uh, I think that's, like Ash said, very humbling, but I think we can also tap ourselves on our back and thank Mani sir again for that. Thank you, sir, for that honor, that great honor. It's been wonderful working in such a beautiful film with such a lovely cast and the music by Rahman sir and Tota Dharni sir and everybody there out there, Eka who did the costumes and uh, Ozzy who did my hair and the horse that helped me write properly. <laughs> I'd like to thank everyone taking a page from your book. <laughs> it was wonderful, it was wonderful. But I hate to say this, more than that, the fun we had was like we all shared just now during the PR. We had such good fun. And I think that again is borrowed from the film. It resonated because most of the fun was us talking about what happened in that film, how Manisa tortured us, killed us and made us promise ourselves every evening, I don't want to act, I'm going to stop acting with this film, tomorrow no shoot, but next morning, though it was 2 o'clock or 3 o'clock, whenever we were woken up, 
we just jumped out of bed and knew that we had to do this and we're doing something so special. There have been movies, there have been blockbusters, there have been big films for us, but I think this one will always hold a special place in our hearts because it's not about being a blockbuster or the, or the record breaker or whatever. It's a film, it's a story that's lived in everyone's heart and it's resonated in everyone's heart in the South, in, the, in Tamil Nadu, and to be a part of that I think is very special. And answering your question, I'm so glad that whatever we spoke last time reached everybody. It's not just Chola, like you say, it's every every state. We have, we have such a beautiful, varied culture. Every state, every town has its own history, has its own stories. And it's so nice to be part of one of those stories, which has been it's become an epic now. And I'm so glad that we are still here to continue. And I'm sure you're going to love the second part, because we all had a doubt when, the, when they made it into two parts. First part was all about introductions. Will it run? Does it have enough juice? And I was personally a little worried. I was saying, oh my God, oh my God. And, and I, was, I was talking to my other my crew members during the dubbing and they said, so the second part is what has the story? Is it going to work? And I was, I was, I had, I was all smiles and I was confident and all that was happening. But I was a wee bit tense inside. But after that response, I mean, I just can't wait to see the second part. And let me promise you that not just me, all of us here, maybe with the exception of Mr. Rayman, is going to watch this film not as a cast member, but as the audience, as a fan of Mani Ratnam Sir and Rayman Sir and all the other stalwarts in this film. It's a great film and I just can't wait to watch the magic on screen. Thanks again, sir. Can't thank you enough. I'll bore you with my thanks, but thank you. And thank you once again for being such a huge support for us. Thank you very much. Wow, wow. I think this purity, this... Good evening. Very happy to be here. And, uh, Looking, <laughs> yeah, maybe a little bit. <laughs> Don't say that, sir. A wee little bit, okay. <laughs> and also, as as you as as I heard, like I, I believe you said it. Like, do we have PS3 in the making? Sir? Maybe. Huh? Yeah. Yeah, Anybody? Yeah, there are a lot of stories. Yeah, it will be there, but I don't know who will make it. <laughs> We would love for you to make it, ladies and gentlemen. Zordar Talia ho jai money, sir. Kelly, it's so lovely to have you, sir, here one more time. And all the best for this, though you don't need it, sir. Rehman sir, bhot bhot swagat hai ek baar wapis se. This time, you know, it's you, money, sir, and Gulzar Sahab. We've all heard, and we are in love with that anthem, PS2 anthem. Please tell us something about that. Uh, it's always uh, a great honor working with him, Mr. Money. Rathman, it's great cast. This movie is going to be a bookshelf movie. No, you're gonna, people are going to see it for the next 50 years. Yes. And it's made like that, and they're all performed like that. Every one of them. It's amazing. So I'm great to be a part of that kind of experience. Um, working with Gulzar Sahib, again, it's like home, you know? <laughs> sense of confidence, sense of trust, sense of security when it comes with Gulzar Sahib. And he loves working with us. We had a great interviews in the afternoon. Um, so there are no communication, actually. You just send the words. He's done his research, he's got all this stuff. And the tune comes in. So only very rarely we said, oh, can we change that word? Because can we reverse that sentence? Oh, it's close. So there's no, like, I don't like this, change this, nothing. He said me one thing, there are too many words, can you put some more music? <laughs> so it's been beautiful. Yeah. And anyone and everyone who's associated with this project is exceptional. You we have to, you know, give it to, to, to the entire cast and crew. Ekbar zordar talia ho and then we'll take the media uh, questions. Before before we do, but this is the first time that there's one person who loves him so much he can kill him. And there's this other person who loves her so much he can die for her. And what happens there, and I know, does he die because of her? I don't know. Or does he live? You don't know. That is a very beautiful thought. And in the book too, it almost has, a, it's not finished, it's left there for us to conjure up some image in our minds. And Manisa has wrapped it up so beautifully and I just love it. And working with her was phenomenal. I loved it and once again, it was nice sharing screen, screen space and that chemistry with her. I completely echo uh, his sentiments. And um, who better than to actually uh, bring that kind of dynamic on celluloid than Manigaru. He is king of... Uh, bringing romance into the most tense moments in, in a manner which is just so unique to his uh, his storytelling, his uh, way of bringing magic that 
pain becomes beautiful you see love you see intensity and the ultimate romance in the moments that when written on paper does not read like that but is definitely experienced like that and uh, we're so fortunate to have had the you know to to have that creative opportunity to uh, to live those moments thank you it's truly magical i have it first to begin with in kalkisa's writing yeah. that this lady is just so um, the way she's been written in as a character and as a personality um it's just amazing that all the women also in the audience apart from i mean i mean the readers to begin with uh absolutely love this character there's a strange relatability strange because uh i think deep down all of us know that um, we are gray there's not black and white everybody is gray everybody uh is layered as a personality and um, and that's just the, the deepest truth so in life actually um there are no labels there is no compartmentalization about uh, being a protagonist or an antagonist or are you are you positive or are you negative these these are all labels that i think we as people go about um, attaching to personalities we all have all the aspects and all the dimensions and we are reactionary so a lot of what we do and who we are and how we it's 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 so often reactionary it's very and most often emotional uh, uh, the triggers are are experiences and very deeply emotional experiences and that's what so often can be the driving force for choices that you make in your life and i think that's that's the core that's that makes her so relatable and um um uh, when manigaru uh, narrated the film to me and said nandiniya oh my god <laughs> i was like really i, I love it he is a man of we all have said this all day man of few words which you're just also experienced but that one word is enough you know he say one word a look and a nod and that even that little ah uh, that follows <laughs> you know there's so much said in that it was just a natural yes and i'm so so thankful i got to essay um, his nandini and be a part of uh, this um, amazing magical uh, immensely memorable and personally very deeply uh, treasured movie experience for me as an artist and each and every one of us here so eternally grateful that i got to be his nandini his nandini <laughs> thank you sir people are kind of people are intelligent enough to understand certain limitations they see with the wife and uh, beyond all this there is an inherent quality with the lyric writers whether it's even mehboob or gulzar saab or javed saab i mean they come up with something which is um believable and emotional and which doesn't which actually enhances the film and having people like you know gulzar saab is actually a blessing for this one because he kind of he doesn't look at a language he looks at um he looks at it doesn't divide this language is hindi or urdu or anything he just brings an experience to us and we trusted him that's it mera sawal aishwarya se aishwarya hai iqbal from ani hello mani sir ki film aapke paas aati hai to wo sirf naam hi kafi hota hai ya kahani kirdaar un sab ko bhi aap gunditi hai dekhti hai <laughs> गुरु भक्ति गुरु है मेरे तो मतलब एक तो सबसे पहले इट्स अ नेचुरल यस हाँ तो है ही जब भी हिंट हिंट सब जब भी पूछेंगे जरूर जवाब हाँ ही होगा दैट्स अ गिवन अब उसे श्रद्धा कहें गुरु भक्ति कहें कृतज्ञता कहें या प्यार कहें यू कैन लेबल इट वॉट यू वॉन्ट बट द पॉइंट इज दैट इट वुड ऑलवेज बी अस बट वाई वुडेंट इट बी अस आई एम वेरी फॉर्चुनेट आई थिंक एनी बडी एनी एक्टर यू यू स्पीक टू एनी वन वॉज हैव दी ऑपरचुनिटी टू वर्क विद हिम और वो हैजेंट एज येट डीपली एस्पायर्स टू वर्क विद हिम एक्टर्स 
एंड ऑल क्रिएटिव फोर्सेस बहुत एक्साइटमेंट रहती है पता नहीं कितने लोग दिखाते हैं या नहीं लेकिन बहुत खुशी होती है बहुत एक्साइटमेंट होती है आज वेन वी वर गिविंग इंटरव्यूज अर्लियर ऑल्सो वी वर बींग आस्ट एंड एवरीबडी सेड दैट इफ If a message or even that name flashes on the phone, or you, uh, sir, now we are telling you directly, you cannot imagine the excitement. We have shared it unabashedly <laughs> during interviews today in the day. बहुत खुशी होती है, बहुत excitement होती है, और and everybody truly looks forward to uh, getting the opportunity to work with him. और मौका मिले, तो it is very deeply treasured. It is very very. Um, really cherish respected it's a learning curve it is an experience which is unique to itself and um, it shows um, uh, in the reaction of the audience of you viewers i mean it's all good so i mean why why wouldn't one say a natural yes lekin khubi inki hai ki it's so lovely in fact he said that to me recently when i was asking him sir how i was asking the context of others you know when we were just talking as it's sometimes you kind of wonder should one take that call or not you know say yes or not and i've never spoken to him about this before directly and i did i did only very recently uh after we finished ponian no sir and um, he just said the sweetest thing he said um, you know which it's always been be honest about how you feel about the character you're going to essay even if it is me don't just say yes i said no i mean you've always brought something magical bhale iruvar ho guru ho ravan ravanan or ab konian selvan i mean you've always brought something magical so it's a natural yes of course he said but even then you've got to be honest about how you feel about the character that you're going to go as say because you are going to live that character and you're going to bring that character to life there has to be an honesty and integrity and a commitment which runs beyond just i'm going to say a yes but of course but i'm going to say a yes but of course <laughs> very very memorable she has lived on in people's hearts and i'm so so thankful that i got to play uh, nandini then too and uh, she has remained uh, special for the audience and of course to me and uh, today and that was with sanjay bansali ji and today of course with my mani garu i got to play nandini in ponian selvan i mean that's that's just tremendously uh, a blessing uh, to have gotten to play such strong women such uh, layered women and uh, women with um, with character that touches the lives of so many women out there there is a relatability so i'm very 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 grateful the film you make you try to make it as well as you can but when you make a period film and when it is a historical though it's a historical fiction once it's an historical thing you try to go as close as you can to what could have been and not fantasize it not uh, add elements which are not too real but try to bring it you know as close to reality as possible this film was treated in that fashion and the objective while making was simple that uh, it should look like it is happening now or it should look like we are there next to the characters so it was shot it was scored it was put together it was performed casually not like a historical drama so everything added to that thank you